The whole idea of the law of attraction is to be a co-creator with God in manifesting the things that are deepest to your heart. When you use the law of attraction in the right way, you can experience manifesting your desires at a much faster rate than you ever would have had you not made the effort to use it correctly. You can use the law of attraction to manifest faster results by taking the following seven steps. Number one, be grateful now. Gratitude can dramatically change your life, but best of all, it gets the law of attraction to give you more of what you are feeling grateful and happy for. When you are feeling frustrated and down, the law of attraction gives you more reasons to feel down. You manifest more situations that make you feel unhappy. So as the first rule to manifesting faster results, begin to see all the things in your present life that you are grateful for no matter how simple it is. Number 2. Speak of it. It may seem hypocritical at first when you learn of the law of attraction to speak of your desires as if they are already here. In reality, all things are already created. The moment a thought is conceived, you have brought it into your reality. The more you speak of that thought, the stronger it becomes and the faster it moves into your state of being. Think of a child who becomes eager about the thing he or she wants. See how eager they are about it? They look up pictures about it. They speak about what they will do when they get it. They don't worry about how or when it will come. They just know and above all, they are excited about it. Speak with joy about what will come into your life because your words and thoughts about it feeds the creation and brings it to you faster. Number 3. Surround yourself with the things you desire. You may be asking, how can I surround myself with the things that I want if I don't have it? It may not be yours at the moment, but you can borrow, you can visit. Above all, you can place yourself in the environment and among the people who are closely linked to the things you desire. The successful application of the law of attraction depends on you already being in that energy of what you want. It is up to you to create the state that you want to attract, and you do so by being among the things that you want until it is fully yours. The law of attraction will give you quite easily what you bring into your focus, whether you are speaking of it or observing it. You get more of what you surround yourself with. Number 4. Let go. Let go of what you want. Yes, let it go. Know that you desire to experience a particular thing, but don't hold on out of fear of doubt. The more you cling on to the needing or wanting feeling, the more disastrous your manifesting will be. You will only succeed in feeling more needy. Allow yourself to feel full and confident. Those who understand how the universe and the laws of attraction work easily understand the power of their intention and don't feel stressed or needy. They create and know that the law of attraction is working for them and what they create will soon manifest. They create and let go and move into the state of receiving. There is a great paradox that comes with letting go because a very large part of manifesting requires that you give a lot of focus to your desire but there is a delicate balancing act of focus without feeling needy or being clingy. Number 5. Learn to receive. To activate the law of attraction, you must move into the state of receiving. This is something most people cannot do. Many people say that they want certain things but few people know how to receive those things that they are asking for. Most people feel doubtful or unworthy about what they want. Deep within they feel that they do not deserve nor will they get what they are asking for. Those tiny feelings of unworthiness are giant blocks in the manifesting process and can only serve in destroying what you are hoping to attract. 
The law of attraction is a science that takes you deep into your inner nature and allows you to see where you are feeling disconnected as a co-creator with God and the universe. Become worthy and allow yourself to receive. Number six, become worthy now. Become worthy by recognizing that you can manifest anything that you want because you are gods and goddesses and what you desire is only a tiny speck in the universe. You deserve to manifest what you want because when you are rich, you influence those around you in positive ways. When you use the law of attraction to manifest a better life, you are in the flow and in a better state of adding value to the world. The faster you can feel worthy of what you desire to manifest, the faster it will come. One of the biggest blocks in manifesting is the feeling of unworthiness that most people feel. The universe is great enough and there is more than enough for you and everyone else. Number seven, give what you desire most. You may not have all the money in the world for yourself, but you do have something of value. And that thing which is of value to you may be in scarce supply to someone else. Give to others and you will be stunned and amazed by how fast the love attraction will manifest abundance in your life. There is a natural flow in the universe, and in order to manifest more, you must also be in the flow of giving. Give to others as long as you do not give more of yourself. There are many flawed concepts of giving more than you have. This is very faulty. Give only what you can. Never ever deplete yourself. Give what makes you feel happy to give. Give with love on a regular basis, but also be aware of conserving your own, and the law of attraction will bless you by bringing to you much more than you give. As you give, you will get and you will manifest much more than you could ever have imagined, and much faster too. If you think this video is interesting, smash that like button and go watch another video and share it with your friends. Thanks and I'll see you in the next video.